Hey everybody, how's it going? We got us here a repipe uh, here, brought to you by City Water Conservation and friends. Uh, I wanted to start off by uh, giving a special thanks to Davis Silver over at AirTech Environmental who sent uh, one of his staff members to uh, my very own home, which is where this repipe occurred. Uh, to just, you know, make sure, because my home is built in 1972, and we just wanted to make sure the, the walls were clean, uh, no lead or asbestos. Uh, it's one of the things that um, we, we definitely um, try, to, try to focus on what, if ever we are walking a customer's property to do a, uh, a repipe, just making sure we stay compliant. And, uh, you know, we don't want to be putting any harmful uh, particles in the air um, during, during our work. Um, another another special thanks to uh, John Stevenson, also known as the Drip Detective, for his uh, time and putting away putting together this cool video um, and plumbing the uh, main water line from the meter all the way up to the side of my house, and then uh, actually using that um, that that mega press uh, to to make uh, pretty quick work of the gas. Uh, real special thanks to uh, Ray Sanchez from EJ Plumbing. This man was pretty much, you know, working circles around me, especially uh, during the day when I had to go out and, and go knock out work for our company. Uh, this guy was, was, you know, showing up to my house and, and helping to make quick work of the crawl space uh, work. I uh, wanted to, another thank you to uh, the team at Rigid uh, and the gals running their, uh, their, their official Instagram page. They actually were able to put me in touch with uh, their the local uh, sales rep Tim, for them. And Tim lent lent me the uh, RP three fifty one with the uh, Mega Press jaws, so that we could uh, you know kind of check it out and stuff. You know our team uh, our our company does have two RP two forty ones that that we use on our jobs uh, on the daily. But it was cool uh, being able to, to experience, you know, using another another uh, mechanism, especially for gas, since we have very little experience using gas. Um, we own a couple of those 241s and the original plan was actually to sweat everything in the house. Uh, but thanks to some information that I got from another plumber, I cannot remember what his name is, uh, but he directed me over to the, uh, the official uh, webpage over at Vega. And I, I got some education on uh, the difference between what an O-ring is and what their sealing elements contain. Uh, makes me very confident in the, the, the ProPress products that we do use because we don't skimp. Uh, we don't, you know, we don't use any other brands except for Vega. If we don't have any Vegas on hand, then we just sweat where we need to. Um, we and and you know the final mention would have to be my my dad. Uh, this guy actually kind of got the ball rolling a little a little sooner than than later on this thing. Um, he started digging the trench for the uh, the main the water main. You know, just little by little with my my two young boys, and uh, was able to to kind of get me in in the groove and and uh, start start thinking of how in the world. I was going to repipe my own house because one thing I learned is it is a whole lot easier to plan a repipe on someone else's house than it is your own house. And um, it, it, it was it was kind of tough, you know, some long days, uh, um, but we, we got it done here. You know, I think it was like four day four day thing. Um, and just had a blast doing it again, you know, special thanks to everyone I mentioned and, uh, yeah, it was cool. Good fun.